What's up, Montreal? <laughs> wow, that is so cheesy. That's really cheesy, but... We didn't plan that out. I'm Spiro Malandrakis. And I'm Annie Deer. And we're here in the district of St. Henry. In Montreal. And we're gonna eat popsicles! <laughs> it's literally, for me, it's my favorite snack. Me too. Besides cupcakes. Um, but for real though? Mm -hmm. Would you take a cupcake over a popsicle? I might. Yeah. I actually might. I don't like that. <laughs> I, for me, literally, I, I can go with, I have a Mr. Freeze every day. It cools my body down. It gets me all refreshed and invigorated. Well, if you like Mr. Freezes, this place has artisanal popsicles. And it's this hidden gem between houses. Here it is. Let's go try it out. I can't wait to have some real purple. <laughs> Mr. Freeze is just purple to be real. That. Would you like a popsicle? <laughs> Come on down. It's homemade. Fresh ingredients. Okay. So we're here inside Pop Art with Catherine. She is the popsicle. <laughs> you're the popsicle genius behind all this. You invented it. You make it. You sell it. You eat it. It can be all of this. <laughs> this is natural sugars in the fruits. So it's all natural, yeah. We wait for our fruit to have our, their own sugar and then we cut them, we work with them. Ooh. And now, what keeps you from eating all of them all day long? <laughs> I would say on the other day, I will eat, eat a lot of them. But, but they're uh, healthy, they're good for you, so it kind of, it's like eating your fruits. Exactly. I was looking at, what's those bags there? It's a granola. We also make a granola. Like granola bars? Like granola, gluten-free bars. Granola like to add on bags. your yogurt. No, but how do you, you make it in like a bar? Like I can, yeah. I can open it up? Yeah. <laughs> See this? Like ah, this is a bar? No, this is a bag. <laughs> oh, okay. It's a bag. Here is my bar. So I have a small granola bar. So paleo uh, gluten-free granola mm. bar. We have uh, three different uh, flavors, so uh, ginger, ginger, lemon. Because mm. that's, that's not how a granola bar looks when you buy it. And I know that's not real. So this is the real stuff. This is the real stuff. Let's get some popsicles! I'm, yes. very, I'm very excited. The loop framboise? That's 100% I'm having that. Those, I love cantaloupes. Oh, yeah. And I like so, a la framboise. Oh, so would you like to try this one? Yes. Yes. Wow. Oh, <laughs> there I just, it is. <laughs> we gotta get a shot of this. This is my goal in terms of fridge. <laughs> Strawberry yogurt. This might be the hardest decision I ever make in my life. But for the chocolate banana, that just looks insane. Chocolate, that's safe, Spiro. It's not safe. <laughs> when have you seen chocolate grow with a banana? You have to squeeze it together like this. <laughs> okay, I think I'm gonna go with avocado coconut vanilla. Yeah. It's very creamy and mm, you guys have got to come down. Hi! Hey! <laughs> Welcome to our popsicle stand. Would you like a homemade tasty popsicle? <laughs> I know I would. <laughs> you already have one. Oh. I think I need a second one. <laughs> Just kidding, we got a deal going on with Catherine. We can get one as soon as we sell one. So it's one for one all day long for us. This has been the coolest episode. Homemade popsicles, I love this. Heidi! Put your hottie home over there and get her a fresh old popsicle. <laughs> we got all the flavors you need right in this fridge. You got here. chocolate and banana? <laughs> yes. Yes, she do. You got avocado and... We what have it? pineapple, cinnamon, mango banana. Mm. We have yogurt, maple, blueberry. Could you say that one again? Yogurt, <laughs> maple, blueberry. Like it, like it. 